I'm a real screw up. Hello! So I mentioned in the previous video that in this one I was going to finish the interior design of the case. But the thing is that I haven't really got the fab. <laughs> so you mean I'm not going to get the inside finished this time either? <laughs> You're just a. So I was around in all my local textile stores and searched for this specific fabric that I've seen inside my head. And I swear I'm not mad. Though none of them had this specific fabric. And I ended up turning myself to the internet. Googled, found, and ordered it. Wonderful. So when will I get it? Next week. What? Why? Well, because you ordered to spend half the week searching for it. Oh, right. So, yeah, I won't have the interior fabric for this video, but at least I know I have the right one that I wanted, which is a... Oh, right. You still mad at me? Yep. But there's still some things I can do this time around. And I'm talking about the things that will go underneath the fabric. The holders the neck will rest on. The covering up of the river heads. The lid for the storage box. The strip that will keep the lid from falling over. Even though it already stops at 90 degrees. Cause you know... Security! The plastic strip that the future fabric will rest on. And the foam that will keep the base protected. For the neck holders I will use this cork. Just cause it's stable yet soft enough not to damage the neck. And yes, these are the type of custers used for your pots and pans. And I will also use these to cover up some rivet heads, just so they don't damage the base. I'll make the storage box lid out of the same board material that the case originated from. The don't fall over strip I'll just simply cut and install at the bottom end, but also install a thicker one at every hinge, just for security, you know. The plastic strip for the fabric I'll just simply cut to the right length, cause I can't install it without the fabric. And the foam I'll make a little thinner, then cut it so that it fits the case. Okay, information overload. Let's just begin. So I begin.
So I've cut and fitted the neck holders. I've covered up the rivet heads that right now are hiding underneath all of this. The storage box underneath the next lid has been cut. I've installed the safety straps, fitted the plastic strip for the fabric to hang on, and finally I've cut out some foam that will carefully squeeze and hold the base inside the case. Do you know, just in case if you might drop it. Okay, hopefully the fabric will arrive in time for the next video. But until then, I'm Tom Victor Sharon, and thanks for watching. Do you know, in case you would like, um, f you fly, you ruin everything.